What is this? Okay, good. It looks like I just milked nothing. I should probably not do that in town. Just like jack off in the town square. Hey, how's it going? Whoa, whoa! What the fuck is this? <laughs> Got him! I've just been drifting around, being led by circumstances. No, that's not right. And I'll that you helped Bart when he needed it. I can't give a fucking straight face this awful writing. Drifting, kind of like me. Holy shit. <laughs> Quite dead yet. Don't worry though, I have a telescope equipped. Uh, the sprite tells me it's a lady, but the face tells me it's a man. Do that Dr. Girlfriend voice. Yesterday my stove caught on fire. I thought the whole house was gonna put down. You, they're ugly kid. Every kid is ugly. What the? These aren't special in any way. There goes the potion! Oh! It's a perfect fit. Oh! Ooh! Well, that's gonna be a problem. 24 people have died. <laughs> we might not finish the campaign now. Oops. I never equipped the chainsaw. I never equipped the chainsaw. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, I didn't stab that man with a chainsaw. I just made chainsaw noises as I hit him with an axe. <laughs> Holy fuck, I'm an idiot. Oh, he'll have the key for sure. Police, nobody move. Like I kicked his his knee bone or something. Are you oh, blind? Oof. What in God's I I mean better luck next time. Armor broken, what the fuck? I just kicked that board and my clothes exploded. Arcanum. Damn it. Stop! You totally fucked it up! Well, you fucked me, dog. We're not getting in now. You blew it, old man! Holy shit, you blew it! Wow, it's just his face! I can't take you seriously when your planet's called Choco. Welcome to Choco. Keep your nose clean. Is your planet named after candy? Spell shit in hindsight. That went pretty good. The hell is this? It says the sacrifice of fire is the gate to ruin. Place torch if you crave the void. Okay. Uh, I fucked that up. A whole bunch. Hey there. We're, uh... Here in Figaro, what was I doing? We have Edwin. 
I think we need money. Because we're a little low on, uh... Actually, we're a little low on volume, I think. Yeah, I think it's a little too quiet. Let's fix that. That's a little... I think that's good. I think that's a good spot. Huh. This screen's a little snug. I never noticed that. All the other screens fit right with you. Know, this is fine. Because you can see the top of the window even. But the, you know what? I think because they show the relics on the screen, like they rearranged this one, they might have actually a little extra screen space. Uh, yep, there is at the top. They didn't board any screen space on the bottom. I mean, you can still see it, but there's, a, there's like a good, probably, four or five pixels above that. Anyways, what was I up? Yeah, we got a dragon dragoon seal here. And then, you see, he's got the goggles. We have one pair of goggles. I think we want at least one more goggle, though because we're definitely going to get blinded on the river. Blound, if you will. What do goggles go for? 500. Fucking deal. Kara can be blind. Terry. Gotta get in the habit of remembering their names. I'm like a bad brain, but... But just in Terrence, now my mic's low. The mic seems fine. That's not good. Mic's way harder to fix. Might have to wing the mic today. Give that a shot. The mic is harder to uh, tidy up the recording afterwards. I wanted a boomerang on Terry too, didn't I? That's way further away. We also got to be careful because we probably don't want to get in the habit of grinding too much. Not that you really can. Like, there's not a lot to gain, at least now. Um, boom, we can probably sell the starter shit, now that I think about it. Like, later on we'll have to be careful and items will be really impressive and we want to wanna throw them aside too. Oh yeah, we can definitely fucking ditch these starter weapons. We're going to get that boomerang easy. I don't even remember this chocobo wing. 
I think it's because I did change the translation because myself and several other people commented on uh, the Slim Jim and the Red Bull. So we got the the Chocobo. Mm, Chocobo Wing might be the Red Bull. And then the Hero Drink might be the Slim Jim. Whatever. Uh, Butterfly we want to keep. That's for the extra people damage because someone said last time that if our if our offhand's a ranged weapon, they won't be allowed to counter us. So we can have Locke use the Manhunter. The Butterfly, sorry, with the Boomerang. So he's got that. Hero drinks actually sell for a bit. Actually, you know, because I think we were stealing these, or maybe just fine. If, if we were stealing these on the mountain, I'm going to say we may be stealing these from the Scrappers. I want that boomerang, so I'm going to sell one hero drink. Yeah, she's allowed to wear one. Perfect. Well, I thought we'd have to grind a bit, but we're already set. Her attack goes down by quite a lot. Holy shit. I guess it's because he's dual wielding is why. Um, well, still, it's better to be allowed to hit at all and dodge counters than just sit there waiting to heal. Okay. Seven. I have seven GP. I was like, what's that weird seven for? It's how fucking broke I am, despite the fact that I have the King of Figaro with me. I'm the king. Can I have this? Absolutely not. Oh. Um, well, we can we can just go. I thought we'd have to grind some cash. We can just head through the mountain now. Definitely want to rob these homies, though. Remember, we get the free turn when we steal. Actually, no, she can't hitch because she got the boomerang. Punch himself awake, master strategist. Yoink! Just to drive me. Remember, he jumps now because we got the Dragoon Seal right away. I'm going to see what that does. Oh, the meter lets us know when he's going to come back. Holy moly. Some good synergy there, I think, because he holds the spear with both hands, so he's not actually overly tanky. Oh, I fucking stole from the wrong one. Hey there. Dried meat. I wanted to see what the other one was. Bad luck so far today. Here comes Edward. <gasps> a new blitz that early, really? Luke gained a level as well, 332 GP. What the hell is he learning? Does he get Aura Bolt? Maybe Chakra? Suplex, really? Ignores their defense and it can apply stop, X, Y. That's gonna be fun to get the right way. What was that? I should get practicing with that one. Uh, I don't think the manual covers this. We'll check his manual page in a second, actually. He's allowed to suplex everything in the game now because there were some things he wasn't allowed to suplex. X, Y, down, up. 
I had it I had it ready so we could read about him today. Sabin has been through quite a number of changes in Brave New World and in order to make him fit his character archetype, whereas his brother is basically Kane from Final Fantasy IV with tools and a permanent heart on, Sabin now more closely resembles Yang. The mere presence of Blitz originally relegated his regular attacks to the rubbish bin, and his claws didn't even make for decent stat sticks since the best Blitz is all did magic damage. Taking a cue from Yang, the new name of Sabin's game is a lot of punchy elemental damage. With a lot of added effects, his claws now deal all elemental damage and have random spell cast attached. He's then forced to dual wield them in true monk style by no longer being able to equip shields. He makes up for this as well as his inability to wear much other armor with some truly impressive base stats. Blitzes have also been reworked just as tools were in an attempt to keep them all useful throughout the game. The result is a varied skill set that provides a choice as to how to develop Sabin's stats. A Vigor Sabin, for example, will focus more on physical blitzes like Pummel and Suplex, both of which continue his status theme by setting Sap and Stop, respectively. The former remains relevant since Sap is a significant presence in boss battles, while the latter remains obviously useful to disable random foes. On the other hand, several blitzes are now affected by Sabin's stamina, making him one of the best users of this once useless stats. A stamina-based Sabin is a more defensive Sabin who assists his allies with Mantra and its counterpart, Chakra, that restores his team's MP instead of their HP, while relying on the now stamina-based Aura Bolt and Sonic Boom, formerly Airblade, for the bulk of his damage. I don't know if I... I kind of want to make him stamina, because MP recovery will be pretty huge. Early in the game, Sabin's natural stats will make him one of the most powerful and beefiest characters available. Later on, his limited armor options will become more of an issue and he'll have to rely more on his high HP to stay on his feet. One advantage that Sabin has in this regard is that his high vigor and stamina will help him take much more consistent damage from enemy attacks due to how do they function now as a sort of natural defense. See section 4 below. But he still ends up eating a lot more of it in the long run than characters who can actually wear armor. Okay. I think I did it wrong. Yeah. So he's immune to the stop, but that got him. Return of the Dark Sorcerer. I have seen some really weird looking hacks of Final Fantasy VI. Hey, Justin. I saw one with like just random other characters from other games. This is maybe a bad idea if that uh, Trillium counters Pummel, which I think it will, it's physical. That's one way to do it. I think I, uh, I shouldn't have used Autocross, but I could just jump on the Mammoth. The Tusker. It'll even guard at high health, that's handy. Not super handy, because that bird's actually not tanky. That's the one I wanted to rob. Ho, oh, whoa, whoa. Those guys have stuff to steal. They said only steal from humans, but that's a cloud. Yeah, 43 experience, whatever. What the fuck is this other thing? A gum pod. Fuck it. No description. My god. This brave new world is going to be the death of me. I think Earthbound also has a lot of hacks. I think Earthbound has a lot more low-quality hacks.
Terry learn fire too? We're not even at the river yet. We stole a gum pod from a vaporite. Mystery item. And we can save. We'll save as like emergencies, but we're mostly going to save state. That'll help us do stuff like, you know, right before a boss, we can learn what the fuck he does, because a lot of the fights are going to be just puzzles. I don't think jump is good enough. I think they'll counter a jump. Fuck you, flower! He does counter it, that's a shame. But his stamina makes him take less magic damage. I actually don't play a lot of ROM hacks. Like, there's interesting ones. Like, I, we did a Shadow Run 2057, and I think our Seven Saga Run was a ROM hack, but I'm not, like, jumping out of... not jumping out of bed to ROM hack stuff. What's that jump did? There's another gum pod! I need to know what the fuck these things do now that I have a couple. What the hell? I can't even use it in battle. Maybe I just sell it. Maybe it's a null item? I doubt that, because it'd probably just say null. Let's look it up after this. Were these guys trilliums? Hey, well, that's not zoomed in enough. I can't even read it. I mean, you definitely can't read it. I thought, yeah, I thought you couldn't steal from non-humans. We changed the translation, which shouldn't have done anything because you know, things are still countering us and shit. Um, enemy was called a trillium. These do not seem to be sorted. Okay, they're sorted by what they are. If I was a trillium, where would I be on this sheet? There he is. Trillium. Bum, 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 bum. He's weak to fire, absorbs water, he's considered a plant. Doesn't mention the... Well, I guess it doesn't say what you steal from them. It says that resistance is... Okay. Huh. Stealing from monsters. Oh, they counter and you get garbage. Okay, well, now we know. We've solved the mystery. Thanks, Internet. Might be able to sell it for like one dollar. A gum pod? Maybe it's supposed to be like chewing gum? Su Suplex is also physical, I think, so this could hurt if he hits the Trillium. Let's say Bane would have sucked, but she is immune to poison. Yeah, I mostly do it to play games that otherwise you wouldn't be able to access. That's the kind of ROM hack I like. Um, but sometimes you can find like a tasteful balance hack or something like this, which is interesting. Well, it's interesting so far. Can't give it high marks until we beat it, right?
Oh boy. I meant to cancel that attack. Enjoy your raid. He's fucking dead. I'd rather just use the Phoenix down than walk back to the save, quite honestly. My last one, actually. This is a brilliant idea. He's the tankiest. He's got 264. Edward level. 198. I don't... I, I feel like we're kind of starting to... We're, we're level 10. We're supposed to beat the game around 35, so levels must dry up in a hurry. Hello? King Edward, this way, please. Probably because my face is on the money. King Edward, this way, please. Not so fast, homeboy. There's remedies to be stolen. The Empire would never think of looking for us here. Well, I mean, there's nothing else in this giant hallway of mountains. Dried meat. Well, we can replace that phoenix. We've got a lot of money. Um, I think I want the poison protection just in case. You don't want to be trapped in a dungeon and find out that you're missing that shit. And a couple phoenix down just for an emergency. A couple eye drops, even though I think everyone has goggles on. There we go. I think this is a hotel. I know my Final Fantasy towns. Take a nap for free? You better believe it, homie. I just spent money on that. Watch out for holes in the wall to explore. Did you speak with Bandon? I just got here. I'm just robbing you. Wait. Fucking relax. If it isn't King Sticky Fingers. Bannon, we brought the girl with us. Is this the girl who can talk to espers? It seems the Empire had complete control over her. Carrier pigeons brought word that she incinerated 50 of the Empire's best soldiers in mere seconds. That's a lie. We all saw the flashback, Terry. Bannon, don't be cruel. She doesn't remember anything. 
Oh, well, that makes it okay then, I guess. Perhaps you've heard this story. Once when people were pure and innocent, there was a box they were told never to open. One man opened it anyway. He unleashed all the evils of the world. Envy, greed, pride, wrath, gluttony, there's more, sloth, lust. All that was left in the box was a single ray of light, hope. We now confront those evils, and you, Terry, are that last ray of light, our only hope. Your power is a gift, Terry, not a curse. You can use it to save lives. You must understand this. Bannon, aren't you being a little dramatic? A little? Perhaps. But we all do what we believe is necessary for the greater good. You remind me a lot of Master Duncan. I've grown weary. Allow me to rest a while. Sweet speeches make me sleepy. Speaking of, someone important to me was killed by the Empire. I've hated them ever since. At this rate, the Empire will just make more and more people like me. That's why I joined the Returners. But I don't have anyone important to me. That's not true. Besides, I'm sure there are people who feel you're important to them. And they're counting on you, Terry. She actually has no friends. Could have tried something more suave. There's no one important to me. That's not true. Look in this mirror. We're a small organization now, but our membership is starting to soar. Sounds like a pyramid scheme. See, I recruited you to fight the Empire, and then you recruit three more people to fight the Empire. The Empire is arresting returners everywhere. The only thing I can add is that you can have faith in my brother. Edward's always been fair with me. You can trust him, Terry. But don't you dare tell him I said that. Ha ha ha. It's a boisterous laugh. not easy asking so much of you and if we push you too hard we're no different than the empire so we want you to make up your own mind i'm at you know not sure what happens if i say no because before you'd get the genji glove or the gauntlet or whatever well we'll save state it that'll be our ace in the hole please join us in our battle eh, we'll see what do you got here 500 gp i have more than that phoenix down 200, okay. Definitely not buying their way out of the war. Is there no wall holes in this place? Well, well, well. If it isn't someone's fairy charm. Let's arrange it. Block sleep and muddle. Yeah, eventually, except for unique ones, we want to slowly accumulate four of every relic for when uh, you fight a ball buster enemy. Doo -doo -doo. Bannon, he went outside to smoke. Sorry, there's a rock in the way here, bud. Have you made a decision? Will you be our last ray of hope? Uh, I'm going to say no and see what happens. Are you sure? You won't reconsider? No, I think the world should be doomed. I see. Hope. How can anyone put their hope in me? What's going on? What happened? Someone did a number on him. South Figaro. Empire. Took South Figaro. Coming. This way. They found us. 
must make for Narsh at once. But what of Seth Figaro? It's only a matter of time before the Empire makes another bid for that Esper. If they succeed, we're all doomed. <sighs> Luke. I know, someone has to sneak into Seth Figaro and slow the Empire down, right? This is right up your alley. Good luck. Terry, please wait for me. And don't let a lecherous young king who shall remain nameless near you. Luke, get the fuck out of here. Guy's got a point. So how do we get to Narsh? Heading back the way we came is definitely out. We should be able to escape down the lead river. It's risky, but our options are limited. You're in danger here. Come with us to Narsh. You may even gain some understanding of your own abilities. I don't know. I'm a big baby. All right, let's go. What are you going to give me there? I understand you're unease, but even as we speak, innocent lives are being lost. We desperately need your help. Please take this and think it over. A barrier cube. Now here's the awkward part is we got to redo that scene and see what the items are. Barrier cube, tell me your secrets. Sets shell on low HP, it already sounds like a piece of shit. You will? Great! I want to help, but I'm scared. The item better be good. That's only natural, don't worry. We'll help you through it. It'll be a great item. And one more thing. Ah, there you go. This is cool, huh? What is this? It's a lucky charm. I have a plan. Please gather everyone. Right. We all know the Empire is using Magitek power to wage war. The question is, where'd they get that power? I had Lou look into some rumors. It seems that the Empire has gathered the world's finest scholars to study espers. The Empire assaulted Marsh over an esper as well. You mean there's some connection between espers and Magitek? I can only think of one thing linking espers with Magitek power. You don't mean. Yes, the ancient war of the Magi. No, it can't be. My grandma used to tell me stories about magical machines. Were they true? Could that ancient tragedy be playing out once again? It's just speculation. Historical studies have provided a number of conflicting stories. But according to one theory, both humans and machines were infused with powers drained from espers. That's what Magitek power is? We can only fight magic with magic. That's not true, you can just stab them. Out of the question, that would bring about another war of the Magi. Then what do you propose? We return to Narsh and see if we can have a chat with an Esper. You want to talk to the Esper? If we can get it to react to Terry again, we may just be able to wake it. Is that really wise? Who can say? In any case, we can't do anything without Terry's help. Terry. I'll do it. I'm not sure I understand all of this, but what the hell, it should be fun. Thanks, Edwin. What was that noise? Oh, right, the guy. Emergency. You guys are normally out in the hallway when I show up. Ugh. I'll walk slowly. South Figaro. What's going on? We talked about this earlier. Empire. Ugh. We need to see what the safety glove does. I think we'll take it over the barrier cube, because, like, shell at low HP. I think we'll fucking get it up bed for that. All right, safety glove. I'm guessing it's the other way. It's like it applies safe at low HP. Yep. Aren't I smart? And let's put our homeboy in the back row. He's level 11. He is, uh, he's actually weak as shit, 192 HP. Okay. Are we ready? What could go wrong? I guess we're taking this raft to Nersh. Hop on? Why not? This is an escort mission. 
Protect Bandit at all costs. If he dies, it's game over. Hope you remember to put him in the back row. I did. Fuck you. We got to be careful because we can't save between fights on the river, and that's kind of what you do in uh, this game. Surely I can jump while the raft is moving. We'll heal for free, I guess. Well, not Edward. Fuck you. He's tougher than he looks. Ooh, that could be a problem. That's not too bad, actually. Fuck you. I'm not sure if he countered with the fall. Fuck. Uh, left. Whoops. I hit straight. We don't want to get caught in a loop. Because that's just extra battles. I'm going to be an idiot and try to conserve my MP. I just suplexed him into the water. It's a full heal, so just we got to... Perfect, the fireball was the problem, so... Rock. Oh! Give him the pinch. That also, you know, I mean, he's just going to help every single turn. I actually can't recall if the raft makes you stop off for treasure or anything. Nope. That is a big fucking problem. We need that health right now. Nodloid's not to be fucked with. I mean, I could noise blast for them, actually, now that I think about it. Watership probably hates noises. Here we go, homies. And home at. Terry's with us. 68, 247. We're going to have a lot of money when we get out of here. I, I don't know, actually, because like we want to save our MP for the boss, but also we might want to speed up the fights here. Fire, too, is going to be really handy on the boss. Um, I'm going to do this. I don't think Noise Blaster is worth it. The problem is the Nautiloids. And they did not give a shit. This is for you, Mrs. That's fine. Sucks. I wanted to get another health out of the way, but we're going to get the jump in time. Oh, no, wait, we're fine. Good block. An Edwin level. I would love for Edwin to learn uh, Orable tonight. We'll just save state. I want to keep the save point back at the returner's hideout in case we need items.
guy's a fucking weak actually. I guess that's the trade-off for the tentacles. This is a replay? No, we're doing a ROM hack. Well, I mean, it's technically the same game. Um, I'm going to say left is the loop. Nope, straight's the loop. Here we go. Now we're cooking. Now that one I'll use the save on. That implies we're also getting close to the boss. We might have missed the treasure. That's not good. Oh, yeah, because I think you normally need anti air weapons for flyers in this it's Final Fantasy X shit. Here I am without my blitz ball. I'm mildly confident everyone has their goggles on. Terry might not, but she doesn't need goggles to heal. Well, actually, Bannon's job is to well, well, well. What the? It's me, a lecherous river octopus. Hoo hoo. Hee hee. Game over. Don't tease the octopus, kids. That smug fucking smile off your face. Whoop. We might want to muddle here. I'm really going ham. Delicious morsel. Let me get my bib. That's a problem if he does that between heels. Careful, you might excite me. I bet you he counters the fire. Squirt. Ah, put your spear away. He's dead. Muscleheads hate him. No beefcakes allowed. She got got she got darked, blinded by the. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say muddles more likely than an M. Is he burning or something? Oh no! I sapped him. I sapped him with pummel. Careful, you might excite me. Squirt's okay. Although I don't like it if he always counters the girl with it. Naughty children. Time for spanking. Tentacle. This is pretty bad. But I think the sap might get him. I... I don't think I can imp a guy in the water. Sap was maybe just the, the slick trick here. We're just cooking them off with the fire. Actually, he might counter that with the tentacle. No, if he only squirts Terry and that's it. Never mind, that's a problem. Get the fuck in. I think he was kind of a ball buster even in the actual game. But I mean, if he's, if he's eating multiple fire twos, that's a lot of HP we gotta go through. Careful, you might excite me. I'm, I'm okay with the, I'm okay with the squirt counters. Muscleheads hate him.
It's a shame I can't stack the saps, but... Four one out, now we're out of tricks. Oh no, if he kills Bannon, that's a game over too. He, if he tentacles everybody, we just lost. Yeah. Oh well. Nope, that one's a little weaker. I forgot about that. The bosses have more HP. Yeah, I think everything's a little tougher. I really need him to fucking cook off here, that's for sure. You know what I should have done? Should have drank some of these hero drinks. I probably would have not jumped on Edward because he was missing too many heals. I really don't want to Phoenix down Edward here though because I'm pretty sure he'll just eat a tentacle right after. Just gonna, I'm just gonna have a tincture. I think we have enough. I'd rather just beat the fight. So it's a little stressful. We can only take so many tentacles. There we go. That's all, folks. That's not too bad. We, we lost Edwin, but... I guess we thrashed it. Shut up, corpse. Don't bet on it. Oh, never mind. i getting the names mixed up already. They're twins. It's probably just hiding. Ah, it's got my leg! Terry, over here. It's all right now. I'm going in after it. No, Edwin. Don't distract me, Edward. The river is moving. He's always been rather zealous. Edwin, don't worry about him. Are you sure he's okay, Bannon? You should know better than any of us. Any moment he'll flop right onto the raft. What the? I think he missed the raft. Edwin. 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 Oh boy. Edward and Terry race towards Narsh while protecting Bannon. But what about Edwin, who was swallowed by the raging waters, and how's Luke faring after having penetrated the Empire's defenses in South Figaro? Is all going according to plan? Choose a scenario. Kupo? Hello? Unequip anyone? Everyone. You're not wearing anything, right? Good. Yeah, he doesn't like touching a spear. All right. Save over this one. This will be our anchor save. And we're going to do this gang first because we have to worry about step mine uh, in the mines when we fight repo men. And walking right now is not helping. But doing Luke and Edwin is just going to build up more steps. And I, I want to get these guys out of the way because they might have trouble without a town and a place to sleep. Fleeing the Empire's troops, Bannon, Edward, and Terry ride the rapids toward Narsh, but the going won't be easy. Yeah, we'll see. Oh! They're not wearing any fucking clothes! That's a problem.
I shouldn't have killed him. I should have healed first. Yeah, she's wearing like a dagger. They definitely took their clothes off. No more fights, please. I just fucking said. It's his friends, look at that. Oh wow, they fucking resist the shit out of that, and then he countered Fireball. <laughs> you really showed me, homie. I still have my spear on. They might be wearing some weird default gear. Am I out of here? We are out of here, alright, what the fuck are they wearing? Yeah, not what they were wearing. Where's your clothes, homie? I am fairly confident he was not naked. That'll be fun. I can't recall. No, there is a there's a heal right at the beginning of Narish. And these guys are babies. It's just the mine shaft I'm worried about. It's actually gonna be pretty tricky going. The early fire, too, I think, really helps emphasize how powerful she's supposed to be. That's me. Just need a slurp. I'm on my way. I'll just go right through the front door. You're not getting back in here, lady. Wait a minute. Get out of here. Ooh! Hold on, I'm King Edward of Figaro, liar. That hurt. He won't even listen. It's all my fault. You did murder about five of them. Don't worry, I know an old trick. There was an entrance here when Luke first helped me. There's probably some hidden switch in this rock. All right, everyone, be on your guard. This place sucks. Step mine does. 137! We can live through that much, though, as long as they don't snowball. You gotta get that fucking heal off, homie. We're double slowed here. Triple slowed. That fire too works, but we're gonna run with MP real soon. I don't know if I wanna. Um, I don't know if I wanna cook off. Uh, ooh, he's got a rod. I don't know if I wanna cook off my tinctures in here. Well, maybe. I think if we can get through this part of the game, we can start buying tinctures. Oh, we didn't step mine. That's good. That bandit hit react. It always looks like he gets it right in the jaw. Yeah, 
I really want to get through this in one piece because you're not allowed to lose Bannon, so. Here's a trick. What's that? I think it's a security checkpoint? If we follow the path of the light exactly, we should be okay. Oh, that'll be easy to remember. I have a famously good memory. Motherfucker. Well, that's one way to do it. This is where she fell down the hole, I think. Yep, we're almost out of here. Ooh, double step mine. I don't like that. I'll just dodge the step mine. Good luck, you two. Thanks, Edward. this way. Oh, that's where uh, she fell down. Okay. We're almost out of here. The Repo Men could still fuck us. Actually, I don't... These Repo Men might not know Step Mine, the one at the entrance. I, uh, I'm gonna hope we can just get out of here. Don't want to waste time curing the poison. Not the smartest decision of my life. Just don't bite that word. Surprise! Come on! I think we ah uh, we got it. I had a friend get fucked by Step Mine, he warned me, so I'm glad I did that one first. Because, yeah, you saw, like, the last Step Mine we ate, they almost got Tyrion one shot, so that could have been a huge problem after if we did Locke and... Sorry, if we did Luke and Edwin, because normally that's what you do, is you do, like, Locke and Edwin, and then buy all the sweet shit in their campaigns to help these two out, but that wouldn't help you against Step Mine. Man, and King Edward and Terry. That's that weird guy that uh, let her sleep here. Arvis, how are things going in Narsh? The town's still neutral. I've tried to get the people to side with the Returners, but it's no use. Maybe they'll listen to you and the king. How are the townspeople doing? They're still on edge. Understandable, given the circumstances. We believe this young woman is our only hope of reaching out to that Esper. Perhaps some answers might help put everyone at ease. That Esper is either going to save us or dig us an early grave. Don't put him in charge of the speeches. Choose a scenario. Kupo. Well, mission accomplished. We'll do Luke last, I think. Unequip everyone. This one's going to be tricky. What dire fate has befallen Edwin, who leapt from the raft after the fight with Ultros?
Um, I'm gonna give him... Don't want poison, that's gonna fuck us. I want to dodge sleep, but I think I'm better off just dodging blind for now. Howdy. I own the dry goods business out here. You're not from these parts, huh? Well, no matter. Show me the goods. He's uh, got some new shit, so we're going to buy that. Holy damage, and it may cast slow. Hold on to those. And then we can buy some stuff for shade. These are for... Oh, no, these aren't for running. They give him image. Okay, that should be good enough. See you around. Excuse me, do you know how to get to Narsh from here? There's a port town to the west, but a landslide blocked off the road. Lovely. You might be able to charter a boat from Doma to the south, but be careful if you head out that way. Why? The Empire set up a base just beyond the forest southeast of here. The Empire? What are they doing all the way out here? They seem to have their sights set on Doma Castle. Damn it, I don't have time for this. I need to get to Narsh and fast. I'll show you the way if you'd like. Welcome a partner, yes. The Reaper's always just a step behind me. Okay. I guess we can check the book about him. No, 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 not you. Being a ninja, Shadow naturally winds up in the role of Fragile Speedster in this mod. He doesn't use shields because ninjas have no interest in defending themselves when instead they can be dual-wielding, totally sweet ninja weapons. And the armor that he wears is of the don't get hit in the first place variety. Shadow thus tends to die whenever he gets hit, but he almost never does. He does nearly end up with the same problem as Edgar, where his special skill completely outclasses his regular attacks, thus relegating him to permanent back row status. But the high price of throwables, along with the option of X-Fight later in the game, are sufficient to lure him out. Regarding throw, it's now restricted exclusively to knives, scrolls, and stars. No more chucking swords or rods. And each type of throwable now functions more uniquely than before. Knives tend to do the most damage, but are more expensive at only a single target, whereas throwing stars can now be spread like a spell to hit a group of enemies. Scrolls, as always, do elemental damage that can be extremely powerful against a single target since the damage is forcibly split against multiple targets. Finally, Shadow can now set the image status, also known as Blink, on his teammates rather than just himself. So he can throw smoke bombs at anyone. Which, along with his handful of healing and support spells, make him an excellent utility character to have on hand. Shadow's greatest asset, however, is his unmatched speed. Pound for pound, Shadow has the highest DPS potential of any character in the game due to just how fast he can attack. This is why he's balanced by being made of tissue paper. Add to this his above-mentioned support capabilities and you get an incredible addition to any team if you can figure out how to keep him alive. I want to see what these claws do. Are 186. That's a bit of a jump, and they do holy damage. Get you a little bandana. Ooh. I'm going to swap that Tonto for... No, wait. He, well, he gets he gets a lot of he, he gets a lot more evade and we don't want him to get hit so yeah I think we will sacrifice a little bit of damage ah uh, well you know we could wear it in the Imperial camp because we fight Empire soldiers there but we probably want to switch back to the Tonto when we're on the train yeah we'll do that well I think you know you fight Magitek armor in the camp hmm. ooh not there We are on our way. We'll get Cyan soon enough if it isn't a beak or a cricket and a stray cat. Did I go in the house? I didn't go in the house. I forgot the house. A little dog counter attack there. Cat scratch. Holy fuck that hurt. Maybe I should wear the cape and just try to cover shade. Fuck you. Snowball's a problem. That's a big problem with the cat counters physical.
Ah, that's way too much shit. Might be the end of the line. I'm glad I saved it. Annihilated. Well, we're back at the house. What a weird game over screen. Yeah, I guess they just take a knee and it goes to black. This guy is always going to come back every time we enter at least. Hey! You the clockmaker? I've been waiting for ages. No. There it is on the wall. He's been ticking for six, ten shucks, maybe even fifty years. Hot. Quit acting like a damn child and get to work. I told you I'm not child. Ain't no child around here. Don't say such stupid things. What? Go on, get. I'm tossing you out of the belt. Why would you come visit this crazy old man? Well, obviously, so I get a shop, but. Alright, watch out for six rabbits. Now, stray cats are going to be a problem. Suplex that can. No, he'll just snowball for fun. Ah, uh, maybe he snowballs if he's the last thing left. So Cricket's last on that one. We're going to be in a fair bit of beef jerky here. Oh, I think he gets a Doma from the left. Maybe I should have bought way more dried meat. Oh, the holy damage. No, that's uh, slow. Damn it. No, he just does it if it takes too long. That's a problem.
Oh, I thought I had the sleepy time on. Even the dog can't hit him. Oh, that's it for me. That didn't wake me up. Uh oh boy. These are hard fights without uh, AOE. I forgot to try and sell the gum pods. And I have goggles on, okay. Um, they do sleepy time, but I want night cape to try and protect shade. Oops, not that way. Actually, what did he even give Shade for his relics? Is he countering physical? Okay, he always counters with Blight, so I'm dead again. Yeah, I guess normally the dog gets that guy for me. Very tanky. Switch to the man eater. And yeah, he has nothing on. There's an awful lot of soldiers here. Have you heard? Oh, you mean about General? Quiet down. Don't want get to catch us? They say Kefka's trying to drive General Lee out of our battalion so he can become the next general. Don't make me laugh. If that clown becomes a general, I quit. What if he hears you? You'll be jailed. All right, all right. Here he comes. Back to your post. Hey, you. Keeping a sharp lookout? Oh, yes, sir. How kind of you to grace us with your presence, sir. How are you? Spare me your petty small talk. Just do your job or I'll find someone who will understand. What a pompous little prick. I'd like to tell him to his face that he's not worthy of shining Leo's boots. Shh. Do I always have to tell you to keep it down? You're hopeless. Damn, I hate that crazy bastard. I don't even think he's human. You don't watch yourself around him. I hate to see what would happen. Yeah, I hear you. I hear you, soldier. Did you just call me Soldier A? 
You two, we're about to storm Doma Castle. You'll join the assault team. Attack! Yeah, so they presumably have, like, airships and shit. I don't know, just climb it, dude. It's hopeless. Our defenses can't hold out much longer. So, this is it. The battle's not yet lost. I beseech thee, allow me the honor. Faithful retainer to the King of Doma with the courage and strength of a hundred men. Nice Japanese name. Simon the Samurai. If we can but fell their commander, our enemy shall surely break rank and retreat. Sir Grey. Sir Umber. Also Japanese names. Let us be off. Sir Simon, their commander is yours. <laughs> He's got a two-handed Hanzo. What uh, Bushido does he know? He knows Dispatch. Physical damage ignores all their defense. Double damage to humans. 500 MP damage, one foe. Steals HP and MP and sets Sap. He's a human, so we want to dispatch him. I'm Simon, retainer to the King of Doma. The grave awaits thee. Magically charges really quick. I'm sure that'll be covered in the page when we read it in a moment. Hyah! Yep, just fucking cut him in half like a samurai. Oh, the captain's been defeated. Retreat! Retreat to the castle. We shall wait within its walls while our enemies grow tired without. That went well. I'm going to take a break and then we're going to read about our friend Simon.
Okay, let's learn about uh, cyan. Cyan suffered immensely in the original game for being the most physically oriented fighter in a world where magical damage reigned supreme and shitty balance decisions made seven-eighths of his special attacks not worth the fucking lifetime it took to use him. He gets a much-needed overhaul in Brave New World in the form of both the new global physical damage formula that renders his style of combat no longer complete shit, as well as some special attention to his special skills in the same vein as tools and blitz. From the undead vanquishing powers of Mind Blow, that dies at zero MP flag is now used exclusively on the undead. To the supreme physical damage of Tempest, a.k.a. Quadra Slice, every Bushido has a purpose to fill and a chance to shine. Also, the Bushido meter no longer takes a fucking lifetime to charge, and the strength of his sword actually factors into the strength of the sword skills. Like Sabin, Cyan is now denied the use of shields in order to force the Inherent can be held with both hands with his Katanas which helps make even his regular physical blows a mighty force to be reckoned with. Also like Sabin, Bushido techniques that do physical damage will only be half as strong to those without a brave warrior spirit who cowers in the back row. But even with these drawbacks, Cyan's heavy armor and earlier access to Empower ensures that he's just as good at taking damage as he is at dishing it out. Furthermore, the overall lack of diversity in his Esper bonuses more or less guarantees that he'll end up with more vigor and or HP than just about everyone else. Build-wise, he only has two options. You either pump his vigor to solidify him as the resident king of physical damage or make him an impenetrable brick wall. Like Edgar, he has several healing spells so that he can bring his allies back from the brink whenever he finds himself the last man standing, and the fact that Empower also absorbs MP makes Cyan one of the mod's best out-of-battle patch-up guys. All said and done, he is nothing else if a significant improvement over the garbage he was in vanilla. That is interesting. We can mana drain and then heal... Um, Outside of fights. Okay. There's a monster in a box here, and I don't know if we're going to be able to pull it off in Brave New World. That guy was definitely not wearing tech armor at the time. Oh, I'm okay. Nothing a Slim Jim won't fix. Well, we renamed it. These guys probably have some interesting counter moves. Like shooting a fucking laser. Just get the center of gravity and up you go. Oh. Why doesn't everyone just do that when they fight the Empire? That's way easier. Yeah, that dog's going to be a real ball buster. Hopefully it's not too far to the next shop, because we are getting low on these guys. I think I might just throw a ninja star here. Hello. It won't open. Right. Hit it. Youch. Who goes there? Uh-oh. I know I heard something. Meow. Oh, it's just a stray cat. That was too close. A green beret. HP and MP up. Gives him some stamina. It loses a little speed. Uh, and we definitely don't want to lose speed on shade. So, yes. 10 magic evade. Weird the dog's not doing anything. Maybe that's if I fuck up the little context action there. Now he's the fucking troublemaker, I think. Or maybe we fight him with the Magitek armor. General Leo, the soldiers of Doma seem to be preparing for a siege. I anticipated as much. In their current position, they haven't much other choice. General, we're prepared to storm the castle. Just give the order and patience. Attacking now will only cause more needless sacrifice. But General, I'm prepared to lay my life down at any time to serve the Empire. You're from Miranda, correct? Yes, why do you ask? You have a family there, do you not? You'd have me go to them carrying your sword? How could I face them? You're a human being before you're a soldier. Emperor Gestal wouldn't want you to throw your life away for nothing, nor would I. 
Sir. General Leo. A carrier pigeon from Emperor Gestal. The Emperor summons me. I must return to the capital. Sir, understood. Right, I'll leave Dome up to the rest of you. Yes, sir. Just don't rush things, that's all I ask. Yes, sir, leave it to us. I'm counting on you. So that's General Leo. Seems like a decent man for an Imperial soldier. Jesus Christ, I'll hide again. Once Leo's gone, I'll turn this water into a flowing river of poison. It's not a good song. The Emperor's ordered me to return to headquarters. You're not to cause trouble. Trouble? Me? Of course not, I give you my word. Don't be arrogant. Don't forget that they're people just like you and me. Nothing dirty, Kefka. I have no idea what you're talking about. Of course you don't. You fucking clown. Give the Emperor my best, you self-righteous little pods. Is the poison ready? But General Leo said, General Leo's no longer here. I'm in charge now. Hand it over. Some of our men are prisoners inside the castle. If they should, I don't care. What use are fools that allow themselves to get captured? Operation Threshold will proceed as planned. You're inhuman. Yeah. Youch. Kefka, wait. Wait, he says. Do I look like a waiter? He's good. Wait, he's just walking away. Just on the lookout for treasure. Can I fight this homeboy even though I shouldn't? No, don't have to worry about that just yet. I swore you could fight that guy and you don't want to. There we go. Oh, there you are. The Telstar. Get fucked. I'm blind! You like flying, do you? <laughs> well, I'm gonna have fun missing forever now. Oh boy. Oh boy. Preferably pummel the Telstar. Oh well. I'd rather not heal, and that's probably gonna cost me. We did it. A power glove for playing Nintendo games. Physical damage up 25%. Holy shit. <sighs> I actually stepped away for a bit. You had plenty of time to run. Youch. Do I look like a waiter? Good writing. I don't even want to know what they'd say in the other translation. Go away, I'm busy. You, take care of this. Huh? 
That's not terrible. Good toss. Nothing beats the music of hundreds of voices screaming in unison. This is just piss. Sir Simon. There seems to be some activity at the Imperial base. Could they be preparing a new offensive? Hmm. Does not this water appear somewhat odd? Oof. Oh, I think their castle's on the ocean, so the boat would be right there. Sir Simon, this is poison. What kind of evil? Guard our leash. Hurry to the king. Right. Your Majesty. Who's there? Simon, my liege. Oh, Simon, my sight is going fast. I can't see your face. Your Majesty must stay strong. Simon, you've defended the realm since my father's days. <laughs> Thank you. It's over. Our kingdom's through. Not yet, Majesty. I fear for your family. Oh, my chest is on fire. Your Majesty must save his strength. Don't speak. Go to your family. <laughs> Majesty. It's weird because you'd think he'd be getting shit-faced on wine instead of water. Sir Simon. There may be some survivors within the castle. Let's search them out. Scarlet. Scarlet, wake up. Her hair is blonde. This can't be happening. This regular Japanese man's wife. White woman named Scarlet with blonde hair. Violet, my child. You can't both leave me. This is... I can't. Filthy imperial swine. We can't forgive this. The Empire, the empire must pay. He's a little upset. Well, I mean, it's reasonable. I'm Simon, retainer to the King of Doma. Face me, Imperial cowards. The enemy to your positions. I'll walk it. What? What's going on here? Hey. May I give you a hand? I know thee not, but I welcome thine aid. It'll be fine. A little pummel and we're on our way. That was only 33 experience points. Oof. Imagine getting drafted and you're only worth like... 9 XP. Let me have at it. What a disaster. Do be careful, sir. Fifty one, holy shit. Fuck you. Release this poison. Aren't you hungry? 
I can have a nibble. Look, we're gonna have to do this together. The thought had occurred to me as well. Oh, we're on our way if the dog's gonna get one. Whoop. Oh. Got one off as he died. I thank thee for thine aid, kind sir. I'm a helper. I'm Simon, retainer to the King of Doma. I'm Edwin, um, brother to the King of Figaro. Well met, Sir Edwin, brother to the King of Figaro. Yeah, perhaps further introductions can wait until we get out of here. Now would be good, but I must avenge my family, my countrymen. Look, if we stick around any longer, we'll have a regiment of troops down our throats. I mean, we've already killed like 10. I've got a great idea. Let's go that way. Sir Edwin, what manner of metal beasts might these be? I'll explain later. Just climb in. Sir Edwin, how might these abominations be manipulated? Oh, for... That would getting to be quite a pain. And damn it, not even I'm starting to talk like you. Listen, just use those levers next to your hands. Sir Edwin, it appears to be in reverse. Come on, come on. Hey, what are you doing? I can't control it. Then let's bust through. These might know heal for us, so we can maybe save a little bit of the meat. And the lime. It's me, just one guy. That's fucking brave. Ah, uh, heal for us is single target. just for decoration or do you, you attack me in a moment stop right there Yeah, it just seems wacky that they have magic armor and they just send guys with swords to attack the castle. You're not getting away that easy. I actually am. Can't believe we made it this far. Now, how would I get to Narsh from here? Narsh, thou wouldst need to charter a boat from Nikea, but the road is blocked. So I heard. How about we get the Empire off our tails first, then we can figure out what to do. Indeed. What wouldst thou suggest? Well, you're from around here. What are our options? To the south lie barren falls, which feed the waters around the Veld. But a treacherous wood haunted by the souls of the damned stands before it. Only a complete fool would dare cross through. All right, south it is. They'll probably be looking for us in these things, though. Best leave them here. I don't think that's necessarily a great plan. 
They're gonna be looking for guys with guns. Let's throw these away. <laughs> I think they're gonna be looking for us. The castle's fucking doomed. There's a, there's a tiny chance I can maybe go there and sleep. Oh, this might be a chocobo forest. Thank you, dog. Whoops, I let too many build up. I think this is just mana drain. Yep, and then he's gonna counter with the poison. Oh boy. Damn. You know what we might do here? This is a chocobo forest. Uh oh. Might see if we can just sleep in Doma Castle like bandits. Move along, there's nothing to see here. You guys, actually, I guess I didn't wipe out the camp. Um. Pretty sure there's a merchant on the train. Oh fuck, the fiber's a bad one. Actually, you know what? Oh. Just keep blocking, homie. Good money, but we're going to spend it all on just healing items. I think there's a healing spring in here. Now remember, we do holy damage, so we're not afraid of ghosts and shit. Look at that. We want to use the level two move. No, level three. Let me double check, actually. Level two. This is steals MP, but this does a lot of MP. So only undead die when they run out of MP, but we can still drain MP so they can't cast anything on us. Healing's water, I hope. It sure is. Fuck, that's a lot, though. Just defend everyone else's way better at killing shit. Exploder, I don't like that. I do not. No, I do not. Oh boy, my relic turned on. Edwin gained a level, good for him. Where's the part I drink from? There it is. Fuck this, we actually do have to help kill shit. Actually, I'm not sure what Kling does. I blocked it. Damn.
I can't keep healing that shit. Let's just try to run. It's my last shuriken, I don't really want to do this. Well, he got away. He's the one that was going to die. Yeah, this is a problem. I think they just all explode once they get a turn. Yep. Ooh. I'm not waking up from that. Christ. I'm not made it a Phoenix dance. A train at the platform? I can scarce believe that a Doma railway survived the flames of war. There may be survivors inside. Let's take a look. Hey, we can get in right here. Sir Edwin. We can't just wander around out here all day. Let's check inside. Sir Edwin. Don't worry. It's the worst that could happen. It's haunted. What is this place? Let us leave at once. This is not a place in which the living should tread. It's moving. We must find a way off. Can't get off that way. It won't open. We're too late. What's with this train? This is the soul train, which carrieth the dead to the spirit world. What the? I don't want to go there. Without finding a means of egress, we'll not have a choice. We'll just have to find a way to stop this thing. Let's make for the engine. Look out! I don't know what I thought was going to happen. We'll just talk to this friendly ghost. Damn it. So we need sleep proof, which I only have one of. That's a problem. Looking for a merchant. One of them's friendly, but I can't remember. Yeah, I got too many... Too many problems to solve there. That's gotta be you, because you do all that melee. Holy resist. Loses quite a bit of defense, so don't do that. I maybe should have bought more meat. Get the fuck out of the way. Do you mind? Oh boy. And a muddle. 
And maybe poison. This place doesn't fuck around. Man, I, yeah, I gotta find a merchant. I'm pretty sure there's a merchant here on the train. Mithril Dirks for throwing, really. Howdy, folks. I have some great value priced items. Thank God he was tinted. What is this? Makes wearer undead. Ooh, that's a neat one. Yeah, can I have like a hundred dried meat? Thank you. Now we're in good shape. We got the dried meat. Oh boy. Did someone say in good shape? Not if I have anything to say about it. supposed to do there. You could maybe recruit the other ghost. I forget how. I think it's just maybe some of them. It might be tinted different. Or he's not undead. He's just a crazy guy. Speak to him and one will offer to join you. Well, but yeah, one will offer me to join me. The rest will fight me is the problem. I don't want to fight everything in here. Oh, my, you know, it's not that guy because he's the one that won't let us backpedal. So we actually lost access to the shop. I think it's the dark tinted one in this room is our friend. They always join if there's a spot. Well, I mean, I have a fourth spot. I gotta put that other weapon on now that I'm not fighting uh, humans. Well, the conjurer might be considered a human, but... Howdy, folks! Oh, fuck, he's just on every car. Makes wear undead. Now, why would that benefit me here on the train? You're in the goddamn way. Quit it. I really don't want to fight them all. They look the same. The darker one in this car was the merchant. Unless he joins when I say no. Don't shout. No escape. got some... Fuck. I don't think they sell eye drops on the train. Shade gained a level. 
What was that all about? Oh, fuck. Huh? Who's there? It came from this direction. Uh-oh. No escape. We're surrounded. This way's cut off as well. You can't escape. Nowhere to run. Nowhere to hide. But what if I get attacked on the ladder by bombs? Fuck. I think they explode when they die, so what would you do? I don't have ice. Yeah, fuck. How do you dodge the exploder? Maybe they suicide if I just leave them alone? That doesn't sound right. Yeah, he just does whatever the fuck he wants. That's a problem. That's a big problem. Holy fuck. Yeah, they don't sell, uh... Lifts most bad statuses for emergency, I guess, but... Yeah, I don't know what you'd do against the bombs. You just don't want to fight out there. Phoenix down situation's not good. I got poisoned by something. Gotta blow my wad on Phoenix Downs here. It's true that I'm not throwing these mythical dirks, but... Sir Edwin. Yeah, they're fucking everywhere. Tis a dead end. You don't say. All right. 
Has to have some scheme. The time's come to see if all my training is paid off. Come on, Simon. Yahoo! It all worked out in the end. Is this a, uh... Oh, that's not a train car. We're looking for a save, which I hope is a full health save. No escape. Why won't you guys just fucking die, you know, again? Dreadwind. We have to detach the rear cars. Luckily, it's right here. They can't follow us now. And for some reason, this also opens the door. It's not a healing save point. Are you the joining kind? No. I think it wants to come with us. What thinkest thou? Sure. I don't know how he looks different from the others, but sure. Guess you have to hope he eats and explode. I can't remember if the ghost will help you fight the train or if you're on your own. I don't think he does a lot of damage. I think he's just a meat shield. Ooh, that's a fucking nice rod you've got, though, homie. Woo! Another Mithril Dirk. Probably just suplex the train and have Shade Chuck Dirks. Um, I'm gonna eat. Foo, chop chop, let's go, slap the hogs. Art thou truly going to eat this? What's the hurry? I never pass up a free meal. Sir Edwin, thou canst not be serious. Gobbles, nerf, snap. Fully restored. I ate so much, even the others feel good. Thanks, homie. Take that away for me. Appreciate it. Wow. I've stuffed down all I can. Let's go. Please order at the table. I gotta go around. What a fucking world. Sprint shoes. Now, they must be haste now. Um, and we would give them to Shade. Auto haste. Yeah, that'll do it. Gives them 74 of 8. I, I don't know if Evade goes to 99 55. I commented on that last time. If Evade goes to 99, that's fucking crazy. Because he's already in great shape. So Shade should be a rocket ship now. Oh boy. Good luck, everybody else. Just keep blocking explosions somehow. Fuck you. Fuck me. I'll take it. Get inside. Stop where you are. I am Siegfried, the world's greatest swordsman. That treasure is mine. If I were you, Ox, I'd grab Grandpa here and run. Swordsman? You look like a manicurist. Get lost. The Ox bellows. Allow me to introduce my blade. Huh. All right. Let's go. Right here, right now. I shall give you no quarter. I think the dog might finish him off yet. Oh. I mean, he's fast. Oh. 
How do you like that? Whew. Give up yet? Is this guy for real? I'm not certain. Ugh. Chest on fire. Can't breathe. We did it. A mithril bolo. Uh, which I think is the shittiest knife. That was pathetic. Get out of here before you get hurt. Again. I'll still laugh last. Uh, get out of my way, please. Thank you. The treasure's mine. Adios, amigos. Mithril Bolos, yeah. Piece of shit sword. 75 attack, 10 evade. You can runic with it. Can you do anything, homie? No. He's level 12. He's got some meat on him. Is that another merchant? Last chance. I'll buy another ghost ring. I'll buy another ghost ring. Buy remedies, I guess, for the rest. Mind blow the conjurer, don't mind blow the conjurer, you son of a bitch. If it isn't the conductor, how do you stop the train? Look at the controls in the engine room, you'll figure it out. What a nice man. Deja vu. I mean, we could also put haste on Simon because we're just trying to mind blow everything, but I think we're better off leveraging the super speed on Shade. Shade and Edward gain level. New Blitz might be Aura Bolt, which if we stack stamina, turns him into a fighting support wizard. Aura or bolt, perfect. Eh, some Street Fighter shit. Suplex. Uh, actually, I don't know if I want. I maybe I just auto attack the train with all the damage I do. Oh boy. Phoenix down. It's just a bunch of Phoenix downs. Dried meat. Remedy. Six hundred GP. Something for everybody. I should just always have the spook hit him. Nope, I guess Shade can guard that. Another Mithril Dirk, which I keep forgetting to throw, but I don't need it. Might, might have... Howdy folks, I have some great value priced items. I get a bunch of money again. I think we're almost... Oh, you don't want to come with to the boss? You're leaving? Okay, see ya. Guess we're on our own now. Don't be... Okay, good. I think we got a preemptive attack because Shade's so fast. No, not Dispatch. Might be enough damage.
Gotta stop this thing. I think there's instructions somewhere. No? There we go. To stop the train, shut off the first and third pressure valves, then flip the kill switch near the smokestack outside. Already did that. Perfect. Here goes. So you're the ones who've been slowing my progress. Hello? Trains can talk? If it isn't three little shitheads, evil toot. Ah, I should have suplexed it for dramatic effect. Run over. That'll do it. snapped out of it, which is good. Here we fucking go. I've been training my whole life for this moment. Oh, 300. Achievement unlocked. Suplex the train one of those memes. The soul train's feeling pain. Just want to pummel him to put a sap on there. And I think probably Aurable to do while I'm here. Which way? I think it curved to the left. I wonder if he's so strong you're supposed to use Mind Blow. Well, there goes that plan. Thanks for waking me up, homie. What a team player. Bad time to be auto-hasted. I'll remedy him. I'll kill the train. I think there's a chance that Mind Blow was going to get us there way quicker than just hitting him. Because, yeah, Ultros was pretty tanky. 166 experience points. We're sliding very quickly while we celebrate. Very well. You've defied your fate for now. It seems we've arrived. Finally, how about enough of this place? Well, don't that just beat all? We're right back where we got on. The Empire's got to be close by now. Looks like we may have to take our chances with Baron Falls. Is that Scarlet? Violet? We don't know who that is. Simon, is that your family? It's leaving. <coughs> Please wait. Scarlet? Violet? My love, you made me so happy. Don't forget me. Papa, I'll make sure Mom's all right. I don't know what you're going to do. Ghost powers? Because we learned ghosts mo mostly explode.
Just leave him alone. We got to get going, homeboy. We got to get going, homeboy. Oh, boy. When did this happen? Light. God damn it. It's a shame I don't learn uh, Mantra or Chakra. I think Mantra's heal Chakra's MP. I don't... I don't want to be burning remedies on fucking poison. See what we're in for here. This must be Barren Falls. To the south lie Lavel. Tis a land dangerous and wild, inhabited by all manner of ferocious beasts. The Empire's right in our tails. So we can't turn back now. If we can but cross the Veld, we should reach the town of Mobliz on the eastern coast. You two are crazy? Shade. Thanks for your help. Jump? Why not? I don't even know what you do here. Like, we just auto-attack everything. I think there's something boss-ish near the end, but we don't have a lot of flexibility right now, so I don't know if he'll do anything wacky. I don't think Aura Bolt is an AoE. I think it's just magic damage. I guess these guys are pretty tanky, though. We might just muscle our way out. If it isn't Super Piranha, Rhizo Pass. He knows El Nino, and I really don't want to have to heal. Because drink just eating dried meat in battle is kind of slow. Uh, and I don't think we have a choice in the matter. Life steal if we're lucky. Oh, I only do the difference in damage. Okay. So I guess Empower could be strong if he has a lot of health. Give him a lot of health and then uh, cover.
draped in monster hides, eyes shining with intelligence. A boy surviving against all odds. Call me Gao. No. Looks like a crag. Oh, they both have ponytails. Who are you? Hey there, hair brother. We gotta get to mobiles. these baby monsters for the walk-in. I appreciate it. Whoops, I just punched him. Go! See if I can just skip this whole adventure. Whoa! I've just been eating grass for 10 years like a fucking idiot. What's your problem? Thou art a strange one. I'm Simon, retainer to the King of Doma. And this is Edwin, brother to the King of Figaro. Edwin and Simon. Give more food. We're out. Then go get more. I think you've had enough. Scared? You want to fight? I don't want to hurt you. Don't worry, you won't. Not bad, kid. You good. Real good. You. Go got you. Shut up. Be calm. Now, oh rough, rude, and wild one, who art thou? Thou? Thou, thou. Thou, thou. Thou, thou. You angry? Simon, you get mad? Simon, you get mad? Simon, you get mad? Listen, he just lost his family. Don't be a fucking cunt or just climb away from me, stupid crag. Sorry. Simon, sorry. Worry not. I cannot brood on this forever. Ah, me give you present. Craig gives Simon and Edwin nice gift and thanks for food. What kind of junk do you suppose he has in mind? Craig's treasure, shiny. Shiny, 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 shiny. But is it shiny? Does Mr. Thou like shiny things? Mr. Thou's that one over there with the mustache and the unreasonably large sword. Shiny, huh? It's too bad Luke isn't here. Who's Luke? bad guy? He tried to steal my treasure? Luke probably he's listen when someone's talking to you. I believe he's trying to tell us something. Sigh. Carry on. Here. Shiny thing here. Where Edwin stand is Mobiles. Simon you stand where you washed up. Where Craig stand. Crescent map. Got it? Shiny thing there. Shall we be off then? This is my fucking life, man. I can see this ending well. Coming, Mr. Thou? We leave you behind. I already told you I'm not Mr. Thou. So we could just be on our way. Ooh, now I know Gao's different, so let's see if the uh, imp tells us. Here's how to use Craig. Leap onto enemies you encounter on the veld to learn their attacks. Hup. Craig will reappear in your party after the fight is over. Enemies that Craig can learn from will appear on the veld after encountered elsewhere. Gow. Gow. Craig can leap onto such foes whenever you fight them, even if you're not on the veld. Finn. 
Yeah, they changed that, so there's less rages for him to learn, but if you see them anywhere, you can leap at them and learn their moves that fight. And he comes right back. But let's see what the manual has to say in detail. Might say fucking a couple times, which I always like. But is it my old friend, Craig? Gao's always been a love him or hate him sort of guy, and at least that much hasn't changed here. What I've tried to do is make it harder to hate him. Sorry. I've tried to make it harder to hate loving him by overhauling his rage list in the same spirit as the other special skills, thus rendering the 64 remaining rages down from four times that, at least as desirable as the five or six of them that were all useful before, not to mention a great deal more diverse. The mechanics of leaping in the Velt itself have been fixed so that those inclined to use him no longer need to invest a lifetime into building him up. Without going into too much detail, enemies without rages no longer appear on the Velt, and you don't have to be on the Velt to learn the rages. Stat-wise... Gao ends up drinking from the same punch bowl as Shadow. He dies in a gentle breeze. He likes to evade damage instead of taking it. And much like Shadow, Gao ends up retardedly fast by the end of the game, largely due to a lack of other useful stats to raise. Combined with the fact that his only means of attack requires no user input beyond the initial selection, Gao can easily be Brave New World's fastest character. In the end, though, Gao is still the same as he's always been. Useful bordering on broken if used well, but very difficult to use well. As the majority of his effectiveness stems directly from proper slash clever use of his rages, the info found in the print me should prove especially helpful to Gao fans. Otherwise, he's designed so that even if you only grab a handful of rages, those few are at least still useful. And then um, he's got his own section here. Rages, there we go. So he can learn all these and all these. Let's see which ones you start with. Soldier. 66% chance he'll cure, 33% chance he'll attack for double his damage. 66% chance to cure too for free is pretty good. And he'll just rage random shit here too. blinded me. Sorry, I have a cape. And I think we don't have to feed him either. He's just back. Who'd you learn? The scrapper? Ooh, we got everybody. 66% chance he'll do plasma, and a 33% chance he'll blind with no damage. And the scrapper is tax for double damage. Ooh, no chakra. That's probably a good one to turn into. And yeah, if we ever see anyone that we don't know yet, he's allowed to leap him anywhere. So that means we can just uh, like use him forever. Because I think that was a problem before, because you couldn't go back to the belt right away. I think you had to get the airship first. Or maybe you could take a boat. Maybe, no, no. Because if you took a boat, took a boat from Figaro, you'd just wind up in Nikea, which doesn't fucking help. Got any uh, weeb swords? I throw bolos or pieces of shit. I don't think we're anything good till we're in Ikea. Yeah. What a pile of junk. Actually, you know what? I probably want to give him the running shoes. There's a 5% chance Shade took his stuff off when he left. Yes, he did. I think that'll override whatever his rage is given, which is good. I just don't know when you'd want to purposely make yourself undead. I forget what undead does. 
This is Mobliz. Nothing exciting ever happens here. Hello, sir. Carrier pigeons are our only link to the outside world. Please move. Thank you. You pass by a house way up north? The guy there is insane. Thought his kid was a monster and threw it out in the wild. This region's called the Velt. Beasts and vagrants from all over the world migrate here. Okay. You came via Baron Falls? Seriously? You one of those retards? I saw a kid running with a herd of beasts when I was out hunting. He looked hungry. Woof. I threw some dried meat into a herd of animals and some kid jumped out and grabbed it. Dried meat got me out of a lot of fucking tricky pickles, that's for sure. Some of these. Some of these. Holy water. Cure zombie. It's a tonic. There we go. That's when we start getting the percentage heals. And a green cherry has a calming effect. Uh, it's either muddle or imp. Hear about the serpent trench now. If you had a helmet, you could make it tonight here. Well, one of you could. Unless you figured out a way to share it. The soldier in here is hurt pretty bad. Okay. I send things all over the world. How can I help you? Clock juice? You fucking sweetheart. The head of the Serpent Trench lies within Crescent Mountain to the far southwest of here. I wouldn't say far. Any basement holes for me to explore? Sir. No. Some soldier wandered here, busted up pretty bad. Only the letters coming from Miranda are keeping him going. I'm from Miranda. The Empire invaded and made me join their army. I deserted when I heard we were making for Doma. They caught me and did this. Now I can't even move. I'll never see Lola again. There's a letter on the desk over there. Will you read it for me? Sure. I can't get used to Imperial troopers walking the streets of Miranda, but otherwise things are okay. Flowers are blooming in the garden, telling me spring is here. How are you doing? I'm so worried. I wish I could fly to your side. Rest, and know that I think about you constantly. Come back to me, Lola. I'd like to write her back, but I can't even pick up a pen. He is really fucked up. Is this a relic shop? Shit, I'm out of money. Oh, this is garbage. Dwayne and Katrin are 16 and discovering what love is. Okay. Katrin, I... Dwayne, I... Wear a rubber. Fireball counter is going to be a problem. Actually, that's not that much damage anymore. Oh, wait, he casts it no matter what, doesn't he? Nope. Couple more rages for Craig. That's another good steal if we can get tech armor.
Well, yeah, it's grayed out if we don't know it, so he's definitely learning tech on here. Yeah, they don't even get XP on the belt. Oh, that's fine, it's not like you level up a lot in this game. Ooh, that'll be a good one to steal, too, if we fucking live. That's bad. I think we'll get a game over if Craig's not with us. Oh boy. I was not expecting bombs, I guess. Fucking bombs. Um, now we get to play the dangerous game of save or save state. I'll take that. Yeah, I spent my money. Just run if we see bombs. Immune to holy damage. What do we have here, homie? Albatross, he does fireball more than he attacks. Barrier, it's okay. Cave Bright Plasma, I think I'd rather, yeah, probably just Albatross. Albatross hits everybody. That gives us some AoE. Well, Albatross and the, the Trench will be handy. I'm a bomb. No, I'm not a bomb. I'm just out of Oh, fuck. That barely hurt. Oh, maybe they explode for how much health they have left. That either hurts like hell or it's just most of your health. Hurts like hell.
Yeah, they split from a shelf they had left. Okay. This is manageable. Re-rise, re-rise, really? Did you get the specter? Spirit. Demi and quarter, ooh. That's probably a good ball buster on bosses if they're not immune to it. Simon, I think Craig's shiny thing is here somewhere. Sir Craig, where might this treasure be? Well, Craig, forget. No. Shall we look around? We have little choice. I can't remember if I have to actually find it or just walk over it. What is it, Craig? Something there? Go! My coin pouch! All my money was in it. God damn it, Craig. I did not fancy thee a believer in worldly wealth, Sir Edwin. Oh. That's only some of the money. This be thy treasure, Sir Craig? Treasure, yes. Tis just a glass ball. This isn't shiny. Idiot child. Hey, I think this thing will let you breathe underwater. But there are three of us, Sir Edwin. I'll be good. I've had training. What? And what of Sir Craig? I don't know. Can't he just act like he's a fish or something? Isn't that what he does? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it worketh in that way. I'm thinking the same fucking thing, my man. Craig Fish, go. Let's go. <laughs> Can't he just pretend he's a fucking fish? <laughs> Can't he just pretend he's water? Can't he just pretend he's a boat? We'll just get back home that way. These rapids look quite rapid. No kidding. Aren't they having second thoughts? Not sure I'm having first thoughts, but unless we hop in, we won't see our friends again. Let's go! Uh, there's definitely treasure down here, though. Channel your inner albatross, Craig. Fireball underwater? Reese's for breakfast? That also makes him float. Oh, because he's a bird. But <laughs> it's kind of his thing. Am 
Megavolt underwater is kind of a problem. God damn it. Last one fucking cooked off. Well, Craig's in for some fun. Who knew a heel? Scrapper. Ooh, we don't want to do mind blow down here. Punch. I mean, that's a good punch, but... Now, someone else knew Kyrtur as their main. Who fucking was it? Conjurer? No, Conjurer knew re-raise. Can't open the menu because we're on rails. Conjure soldier, vaporate. Soldier new cure. You fucking good memory. No, oh, that's your fault. That's your own fucking fault if you die from this now, Craig. Craig, help. Can't he just pretend he's a retard or something? Isn't that his thing? to get to a cave here, eat some jerky. Oh, an imp. You don't see imp early that very often. He might keep guarding Craig. Ooh, not for magic. End of the line. You ever seen an imp? No Bushido? Once. God damn it, please tell me that's your killing shot, thank god. 250 experience points, Simon gained a level. Mastered a new technique. Oh right, Bushido. Please just fucking let me eat. Thank god, this one looks cavish. Can remedy that too, I think, yep. Yeah. Seventy-eight. These guys are fucking beefy. I'll give them that. Is that from another turn, or yeah, I think that's maybe from another turn. I'm not gonna be too excited about missing out on like sweet relics and shit, but. White cape for clan rallies. What's white cape magic shit? Blocks imp, mute, and berserk. I wonder if I resist berserk on Craig, I can choose what moves he does. I don't think so. Time really got away from us, unfortunately, tonight. We won't have time to do uh, Luke's chapter. I'm fine. Did I get enough money there to buy stuff? Not really. 
South Figaro bound fairy. I still need to shop. Uh, because we can use all this shit to fight once everyone meets up. Got any imported goods? It's got some drive meat. No one can reach this town except by sea. That's a terrible place to build a town. Little kid like me doing business. Sad, ain't it? If there's any pity in your heart, buy something, will ya? Ooh. Blocks blind and poison. So it's a goggle taped to a bracelet. Fairy charm, I have, but I don't have a lot. Okay, so they sell these now from the returners. Blocks, imp. Um, Chest Edgar can be the Dragoon. I think Mog can also do it. Buckler, Katana, Karate Gi. Iron Shield, no, we're not gonna. This isn't too, too amazing. Weapons, I think, is what we want. You're in the way. No, you're in the way. What a bitch. Spear claws I have now. Poison claws I don't have. A stout spear would be a woo. An upgrade. And then we have these. Ka Kotetsu may counter attack. fucking town. A chocobo stable? They said there's nothing out there. It's all mountain. Oh fuck, there might be a wacky... Might be a rage we can learn when we really shouldn't. We also might just be near Narsh. I mean, they know Snowball and shit. If he's not allowed to learn it, it won't say leave. We can learn it. Tell you what, I should have done to save the game. We're gonna have to redo the trench. Beating fucking snowballs. There we go. Good advice. Edwin gained a level. Oh, we didn't see what technique he learned. He learned uh, level four Bushido. Old woman. A rock slides blocked the path leading east. Yeah, no shit. Clean bed for 150. Sure. This one's got cum stains on it. 65. I'll pay the 150. Come on, I'll flip the pillows over for 70. Conjure, yeah. The only thing, I, it, I think the rage might have some legs in this one just because you can learn it anywhere so it's easy to stay on top of it. But I think if I could see that, like if I could see the moves before I pick it in battle, that would help a lot. Stray Cat. Snowball attack for triple. Wow. That's a good one. Clock juice for the road? You know it. Uh, 
I don't want to get the shit kicked out of me by stray cats again, but we can look for another rage or two, because... I know for a fact that uh, the Moogle charm's gone. There's no relics that manipulate the encounter rate, so... I, I want to use Craig a little bit. Like we we got to get the hang of him, because sometimes we're going to have to slip the party. And it might just be fun to use him. Look at the repertoire he's already got access to. I forgot to see what the new uh, Bushido was. Four physical attacks that might muddle. That's a boss beater. Just stray cats again. We'll do one more fight. And I'll just have to assume it's just all stray cats out here. Three cats out here. Yeah, I would have liked to do all three of them and have the the gang meet up, but I know Luke's scenario is going to take a bit, so we'll we'll wrap it up here, and then next time we'll do Luke's scenario, and that should be, uh, yeah, we should we'll definitely have time for Luke's scenario, and then the battle for Narsh, and I don't think we'll be able to beat Zozo next time. The pube. About 13 years ago, I helped deliver a son for the strange old man living at the mouth of the Leet River. I wish I hadn't. The mother died during childbirth and he lost his mind. He thought the bloodstained baby was a monster and threw it out. Probably killed the poor thing. Hey there, handsome. Fancy a drink with me? Only 50 GP for my time. How dare you, you filthy strumpet? Off with thee. Hey, don't be so uptight. Let's have some fun, baby. <laughs> <sighs> oh. B baby Settle down, Simon. Eventually she'll get bored and leave you alone. This behavior has no effect upon thee. I'm a monk. We trained for this. <laughs> He's an expert at beating his me. Oh, I like your friend too. How about twenty GP for the both of you? That's a discount. Enough, have you no shame? Lady should be modest and dignified and Good work, you've made her bored, let's go. There used to be ships sailing to the southern continent, but that was before the Empire took control. Speaking of ships, let's get the fuck out of here. By which I mean, let's check over here. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Yeah, those stray cats don't even give us money. They fucking saw us coming. Classic Final Fantasy VI trick, though, is to just load up in here and then use it on the other two chapters. Set sail. Please. South Figaro, hop aboard. It's a steamship. No sails for us. Narsh is but a stone's throw away. I hope the others arrived safely. I would fucking hope so. We pretty much had to walk to Australia to get here. His took the longest. Surely they must have. Worry not. Craig hopes so too. Like... 
Edward and the others got there and had to walk through a cave. Like, they were really taking their fucking time if we all get there at the same time. Choose a scenario. Koopo, unfortunately, unequip everyone. That's not what I wanted. We missed the coveted 420 save file. Oh, well. Luke's worked hard to stymie the efforts of the Imperial troops, but now he desperately needs to escape. Why, well, he could be anywhere. I better turn around. Damn it. Gotta get to Narsh on the fly. I mean, I would swim, my man, but this is a problem for next time. Uh, I don't think there's a lot of fighting in the loot campaign so it won't be that hard but it still takes a little bit and i don't want to go really over time so thanks for coming out to watch we'll be back next time with some more brave new world didn't get super fucked which is good i think we're making good progress still had a couple close calls on the train with the bombs but the further we go the more items and tools and shit we get access to so it'll get easier i hope might hit a wall once we get the espers and it expects me to be a little more wily, but I think we're making good time. I think we're making good progress. I'll see you next time. Like I said, we'll finish Luke's campaign here and uh, do the battle for Narsh. Maybe get uh, close to Zozo or maybe do Zozo. We'll see. But I'll catch you next time. So until then, 